Bring past you to you. Hi, help Willie. To Donato. We want to get as close to the white, the lighthouse as we can. So then tomorrow morning, we just have to do like 10, 15k. We have 90 kilometers to go. There's Mount, Mount Daigetus. Where's the sunrise? Okay. Right. We had 65 forms this way. I'm going to try and knock out another 45 today. I've done 25. We need to 70, I guess which is optimistic, as I always am. But even if I fall short, it'll be a good effort. I want to do a PB today. I think, what's the longest I've done? 62, three? I can beat that. Uh, so we're in East Money, in Githyo. We're going, uh, Gail's going to go to check out the shipwreck, get some shots, and uh, the prison, which there's a story there. Um, and uh, yeah, then I'm making that in uh, Ariopoli, where I uh, this whole idea started. So we meet up there, rendezvous. Uh, yeah, rendezvous at Ariopoli, and then I'll probably do another 10, 15, and uh, get as close to the lighthouse as possible. Sleep. I'm so quick. <coughs> Is he still tracking? I'll see you money. Look how big this thing is. Isn't that ancient? You so thick at the base. Money's mountains are doing their worst of my knees and ankles as I'm trying to get in the last 50 kilometers of this march across Greece. Couldn't find a more just treacherous landscape than money in all of Greece, maybe all of Europe. This land, a uh, British writer said, when uh, God was making the world, Whatever leftover rocks he had, he just threw them in money. It's very accurate. It's very rocky, it's very mountainous. And uh, it produced, that terrain produced, some of the toughest fucking people in the whole nation. Let's not forget, it was here that the modern Greek state started. It was these mountains that were never conquered by the Turks. Because they said, you know what? We can uh, break our backs trying to conquer this mountainous land and have these people ambush up us from the mountains every time we try and do it. Or 
Leave them be. There's nothing here. There is nothing here. There are no resources here. Leave these crazy people in the mountains. And that's what they did. The maniates, the clefts, I mean the thieves, because that would go down into the uh, Ottoman lands and steal, like lambs, for example, and then cook them like clefts quite any. This was their life for hundreds of years of occupation. And just as hard and tough as these bastards were to the Turks, they were tough and hard to the other Maniotis. And that's why they are well known for vendettas and uh, their feuds, blood feuds. I've just come over from the east to the west side of Mani. And I've just gotten the city of Kalamata in my view, which is crazy. But I know this road because I've driven it about six months ago when I came up with this idea of a march across Greece. The uh, rain clouds have uh, cleared, there's still some lightning in the background. But uh, now the beautiful stars are out and because there's such low population here, it's very clear. And it's beautiful. I'm getting beat down by this mountain. And I know that uh, I go down this hill a bit and then it's a crazy steep hill up to Adelpoli. So I'm not looking forward to it. There's only 5k to go, but it's going to take me 90 minutes. So uh, we have made it to money. We have made it to Adeopoli and we have made it to uh, Black Mike, Mavro Michali, the grandfather, great grandfather, uncle cut, something like that, of uh, Kologotroni. And you will see where the uh, modern Greek state started. You can see the flag that I've been hauling across the niche is right there. You might be asking, hey, George, what does it even say? Well, I'll tell you, buddy. Niki Thanatos, also the, uh, I don't know, motto or saying of our country, which means uh, victory or death. And some flags at the bottom, that one doesn't say, but my one does and a few others do in this town I've seen up now, say uh, at the bottom, um, with your shield or on it, which is a Spartan, ancient Spartan uh, saying from uh, Leonidas days. So uh, second shift done, we're going to eat some uh, hopefully kleftiko a la and uh, yeah, take a look around, but I've uh, got to do a few more case tonight, my hips, forget about it, uh, but yeah, really great to be here, let's find some kleftiko. Okay, so uh, we had a feed and we realized we got to be uh, at least in Athens by 6 p.m. So, uh, means we need to uh, hurry along. So, uh, we're going to see how many kilometers I can do before my hip breaks into 14 different pieces. The wind is not on our side, I don't believe. But uh, we want to limit the kilometers we have to do tomorrow. Nope. Watch started. As much as I would love to stay here and talk history about Adeopoli and the uh, Greek independence war, we got to get a move on, mate. I'll see you when I have no more hip left. Yep.
Now, I spent a lot of nights uh, alone looking up at the skies, but through Greece, they aren't ever as bright, the stars, as they are here in Mani, because it's so depopulated and lacking in uh, light pollution. I thought I've seen a few shooting stars, but I, you can never really know, but I just saw like a cartoon character-esque shooting star. Like with the whole tail on and everything. Fucking amazing Commodore. Wow. And I made my wish. Just did a quick 11k. Save that. Today we did a total of 63k. I think it's a PB, right? I think the biggest one was 62. Yeah. 15 hours from just south of Sparta all the way to about halfway through Western Money. So the game plan is wake up. Shut up with the ad today, Malanaka. Um, plan is to wake up at 5 o'clock, do the last 30k, about 6 hours, and try to finish round 11.